Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited to be sharing my Amazon favorites. These are must have items that I absolutely adore and love and they are all from Amazon. So everything will be linked out down below in that description box in case you guys wanna check any of it out. And I have a big mix of everything from home decor finds to organization to beauty, fashion, and just lifestyle favorites. So a good mix of everything and definitely give this video a like if you guys enjoy these Amazon favorites. All right, we're gonna start with one of my absolute favorites and unexpected finds. I got these like two months ago and you guys, I am so excited that I found these to bring into my home for springtime and they are these faux hydrangeas that look so insanely real. They feel real and they look real. So I have them in this vase right here. I found this from Walmart, but this, has these really gorgeous pink hydrangea stems. These come in quite a few other colors. My mom went and picked up the white in her home and the pink, and they look so beautiful on her nightstand. I'll have like a little overlay of what the white ones look like on her nightstand, um, but these are just insane. I just can't say enough. I have a hard time finding really good floral sometimes that don't look super cheesy, um, because a lot of times like, I don't know, it's just hard to find something that looks realistic um, and these really do. So they come in tons of other colors. I know a few colors are taking a little bit longer to ship. I know I had to wait, I think like two weeks to get them in possibly, but it was well worth the wait. Um, so these come in a pack of three. I do have in this like pretty large vase, I have, let's see, I think about three. Okay, I do have four sets in this vase, but this is like a really large vase, as you can see of hydrangea. My mom just did two packs and for the price, you could really have a gorgeous looking centerpiece. Oh, and I do wanna mention, they do come with just like the um, floral portion and then the stem separately, because this actually just came off because I accidentally, I was trying to pull one of these out. So you just have to pop on the floral part when you get them in and then they just stay on. I've never had an issue with them coming off until right now because I literally like yanked it out of the vase, but um, they're so easy to assemble. And then um, you just literally pop them into a vase. I did get like wire cutters because they are a pretty thick stem and I had to cut some down just to shape them into the vase. So I will link them on Amazon because I ordered them on Amazon. My mom actually borrowed them from me, which I don't have them right now. She had to borrow them for her vase. But um, yeah, they are amazing and truly gorgeous, especially for spring and summer for just adding a really fresh look to your home. They truly will like last and you just rinse them underwater and let them dry on like a bath towel or something when you wanna just freshen them up and get them clean. Let's switch gears to something fashion related. This is a fashion related tool and this is called the micro stitch. So if you ever had like a top that was like slightly gapping where you felt like you wanted a, like a safety pin or something, or if you just had the time to sew it um, really quick, like a little tack, or if you need a quick stitch, like a, a piece of clothing under the arm, or you need to hem something really quickly, like a slip or underlay to a dress, um, that way you could hem really quickly with this micro stitch. So this reminds me so much of the tagging devices they use in like stores and boutiques. Um, I have one actually for my online colleagues or Karen Rose and essentially you just fill this in with like little tags, but this is the micro stitch version. So it's the really teeny tiny and they literally make like a tiny stitch um, into your clothes. So you just take this little cap off and then puncture it through the fabric. Then you just like click this like little button here and then it will make the garment stick together. Um, just be careful, of course, as this is like a needle, so you wanna be super careful when you're using it and use caution, um, but this is incredible and it just has saved me already quite a few times. I just used this for my Taylor Swift concert dress. It's a sequin dress and I could not get a seamstress to tuck under this like little section here in time enough because I kind of made it to the last minute, which is totally my fault. So I just used this and it totally worked for me. I mean, it's not a long-term solution, but if you're looking for a quick fix on something, I'm planning on using this too. I have a slip that I put under like more sheer white dresses. And sometimes some of the dresses are a little bit shorter. So I just hem this with a couple different, you know, stitches with this. And this also does come with like a black stitch things too. So if you have darker colored clothing, this one is like white or like clear, but then there's also like black. So this is gonna come in handy for me. I have a feeling a lot. Okay, because it is warming up and becoming like full blown self tan season, although I self tan 
all year round just because I personally feel better with a glow. So I'm gonna share one of my nice like gradual self tanners that I love. I have a couple different ones in my rotation. I love Saint Tropez Mousse, I love the Loving Tan. I have a few different favorites, but this one is amazing if you're looking for extreme hydration and clean ingredients. So for the face, I really do like these. Um, this is called Beauty by Earth. So the whole line, I have the body and then this is the face drops. So I just put do my regular skincare routine as I usually do. And then whenever I wanna have a little bit of a glow to my face, I will drop a few drops in my hand and I just personally apply it right directly to my face after moisturizer. I don't mix it with my moisturizer. I find that it comes up a little bit darker when I do that. But if you want a very like l very faint glow, then um, just put this in with your moisturizer, like a drop or two, just even start off with. And then you could gradually um, introduce it in case you're a little worried of how it's gonna turn out. But this is amazing. I love this brand because it's very clean ingredients. Um, and then also they have the body lotion, which I can't even tell you how many times I've repurchased this. Probably I wanna say maybe five times at least. And this is amazing. This kind of is like the glorified version of a Jergens natural glow, if you're familiar. Uh, that's what I used to use in high school, but this has very clean ingredients. And also um, it just has a really nice color and it hydrates me because the Saint Tropez is great um, for like, it doesn't really dry me out as bad as the Loving Tan like really dries out my skin. So like in between or like, you know, here and there just for like every day, I do like using this if it's not like a special occasion or event. This is really nice. With outdoor entertaining and like patio season coming up, I wanted to share this really fun lamp that I have been on the lookout for one of these. So one of my favorite hotels and areas is um, the Colony in Palm Beach. And they have these table lamps at their, um, it's called the Swifties restaurant. And they have these on the, every single table. And I've always been fascinated by them because they're just so cute and they're like a Palm Beach vibe. And then you just literally tap the top and these light up and will glow. Three, they have like three different settings and you could just literally tap that little silver button right at the top. And this is just so nice if you're outside, if you have like a screened in porch or even inside your house and you just need like a little lamp and you just want like it while you're reading or something and you don't wanna like light up the whole room, it's just a nice alternative to a lamp without needing to be like plugged in. Um, but these are especially great for like on your patio, even at night, if you're hosting or entertaining and it's getting dark out in the spring or summer, I think this is really nice to have. So you could have like a dinner or if you're like just sitting outside with friends or family, I think this is really nice. The actual ones that the colony has, I believe I looked them up, they were like $170, uh, but I found this on Amazon for a fraction of the price. And um, cause I've just recently got this in, so I still have the box. Um, but basically it adapts to your mobile phone charger if you need to charge it up. And the height of this is 14 inches, by the way, by like four inches wide. So it's a nice like smaller profile if you don't want something big and bulky too, even inside your home. And it even, it shows like it comes in like tons of other colors, like with gold and a few different others. So I was really excited to find that because I just love the colony. So I wanted to bring a little piece of it home. Up next is this mirror. I wanted to get a really good mirror. I could get close up when I'm tweezing my brows and for just like seeing my face, like when I'm doing my skincare a little bit better. And this is amazing. So my mom told me about this brand from Amazon actually. And this has like this magnification like section cupped on here as well. Um, but I don't really use that as much. I mean, you could take this off and then even have it as like a handheld mirror, but I just mainly use it for like the full mirror. And then it also lights up as, which is why I kind of like really like that. So I have like really good um, lighting when I'm, you know, tweezing. Cause sometimes it's like hard to see your brow area. So it has like different settings for different lighting and I just love it. And it even has like a little tray here. I keep my tweezers in here and just some like random beauty products sometimes. And this has like a nice tilting feature. And then, like I said, you just pop this on with the suction cups if you wanted to add that magnification. It's really handy, so it's a really good quality mirror. And um, the price point was, I think, right on under $50, I believe. But yeah, my mom has one of these. I think she has like the round version, but yeah, I really love that. It has the light up feature and it's just really nice. Okay, up next is a fashion favorite. It is a designer look for last for the Van Cleef bracelet. So I've had one of these on my wish list, but I don't know like how much I would wear it if I would love it, like if it incorporated with my style. 
So here it is right here. I actually just had it off to the side because I didn't want to forget. Because sometimes when I like wear things and I want to talk about it, I like forget because it's not like on the pile in front of me. So I had it laying there. So I'm gonna put this on now. So this is so nice because it just blends in really nice with a lot of my bracelet stacks. And I have it on with my like Cartier look for less too from Random Fry and they just launched this like new gemstone bracelet. It's really pretty. I love this all stacked together. I will include details below for you guys. And I do have a code for Miranda Fry. It's not sponsored. I just share it in case you guys want to save extra. But yeah, this is so pretty and I love it so much. It's so classic. I believe it comes in a couple other colors and like most Amazon things do, but it's so pretty and it's health up great. Um, I know the reviews might be mixed if I remember correctly, but uh, it's not, it hasn't broken on me and I've worn it like a lot recently whenever I'm like storing usually or doing try-ons, like most of the time I have it on. So I really love that. Okay, up next, I just filled this up actually for my trip because I leave tomorrow. Well, when you guys see this video, I will have already been on my trip to Tampa, Florida. It's my 30th birthday trip. And then we're going to see Taylor Swift in concert, which is so exciting. So anyways, yeah, I just filled up some things for travel and this is one of them. This is my hand sanitizer. I just did an Amazon travel must have. So if you even want more Amazon finds that are travel related, you could check out that video. Um, but this one is so cute because it's a hand sanitizer bottle. It comes empty and then you just fill it. I just filled it with pure all hand sanitizer. And then it has like the little scallop detail with a snap. So when you want to like fill it up or whatever, if it's all on here, it's quite a bit. And then it has like a little keychain. So I'm gonna hook this into like the D-ring of my bag for my personal bag for the flight. And this will be perfect. So I know exactly where it is when I need to use it. So it came in a two pack, uh, the pink one I gave to my mom to use. And then um, this is the gray. So I thought these were great. I think these came in other colors too. If you can't tell, I have been on a floral, faux floral kick. They're just like so perfect for springtime to like transform your home. So these are really great too. These are another one of those like looks real, feels real situations. And these are stunning. These are in a gorgeous medium pink. I kind of wish that they had them in like a blush. Maybe they do, I have to recheck, but um, they have them in quite a few other colors. And this is like the medium pink, they're gorgeous. I'll write the exact color names because I know some of them are kind of similar, um, but these look and feel again, so real and they look realistic. I use these for like the Karen Rose spring um, photo shoot and these looked really nice like and they popped and I feel like they just look really cute with a lot of different florals. You could add eucalyptus to this would look gorgeous and other greenery to like fill out a vase. And um, yeah, they're gorgeous. Here's like the color comparison to like the hydrangea and the pink. Yeah, you could even like mix and match a lot of these. Since we're talking about faux florals, I might as well just share these. So this is, I just have like a little couple right here to show you guys, but okay, I got these outdoor stems. So these are gonna look ridiculous when I show them like this, but you're gonna see in them and the planter that I have for outside on my front, like my mudroom door, outside of my mudroom door. So these little stems right here, they look so good, like from when you're from the street and even like on the porch, like they really don't look as cheesy as I was like thought they could look, but these are just faux florals for outdoors. I have them in this white planter, which I got the white planter from Amazon. I'm not totally convinced to like share it with you guys that it's that great of quality. So that's why I don't want to share it. I mean, I guess I could link it if you guys want to try it, but it kind of like is fragile that like, I feel like, cause you had to like assemble it and then it kind of like comes apart once in a while if you like carry it the wrong way. Cause I don't keep my mudroom planters outside all the time. It's like, I just find that I wanted to keep them inside my mudroom entry. And then if I'm getting company or once in a while, if it's like a nice day, I'll just like throw them outside. Uh, but for the most part, I keep them inside. But if you have like a covered porch, they should be totally fine. And yeah, these again, look so real. Like when you have them like in the planter and they look so nice. So I think it comes in a set of like 24 of these stems. So this is just two of them right here. So when you see the whole vase, they look You'll see what I mean, um, but they're really nice. They come in tons of colors, but I thought the white popped really well on my porch and just looked really clean and fresh with like my pink doormat, but it looks so pretty and I love those. All right, let's do a beauty product. So recently I've been on a slick bun kick. I just think it's so classy, really chic, effortless, and it truly, it, it looks effortless, but it also is like effortless. It takes like two minutes to do my hair when I do that. So that's why I like to do it sometimes, because it makes me feel put together. 
and yet it took me like two minutes to do. But in order to achieve the slick bun or ponytail, you need this wax stick in your life. So this is by the brand TG or something. <laughs> Bedhead. Um, it just says it's a hair stick for cool people. Um, and it really is amazing. Okay, so you just pop the lid off and then when you need to like get more product out, you just push the bottom and it's a wax stick. So essentially just you slick your hair back and then you just get any of the flyaways or if you want it really smooth and shiny. Um, I did a, the Amazon travel video that you guys will see that I recently did. The last one, uh, my hair was like slick and you could see how like shiny it looks. That's from this because it just really helps the flyaways. And even if you're not doing a slick bun, if you ever get those little hairs, I know I do. They sometimes just stick up and they're like really, it just makes your hair look so much more polished by even applying just a tab it even to your fingertips. Apply it right here where you have some flyaways. I probably have it right now. I didn't even use it today. Um, but you just apply it and you're good to go. Now, if you're gonna use this like full on, then you're probably gonna have to wash hair the next day if you plan on actually styling it again, because it does get, you know, it's a little thicker consistency products, but it doesn't feel like gross or anything in your hair. It's really nice. So I really love it. I just have to say nothing but good things about it. So I was really excited about this discovery because I do not like it when I have like all those flyaways, but hairspray doesn't seem to like last for the flyaways to actually, you know, stay down. All right, moving along to an organizational favorite is this belt organizer. I have a set, it came in a pack of four organizers. So I have two right here. I have my Amazon belt, which is actually another favorite I was gonna share. So I have that in here and they come with like little lids and they stay dust free. And yeah, they just stack up and I have them like on my shelving unit. So you could put them like in your closet or on your vanity or a dresser and they just stay really nice. So I have this belt here. This is from Amazon. I love this neutral one. A lot of you asked for a neutral belt recommendation and this is a good one. If you wanna cinch a random top or a dress, this is perfect for that and it has the gold detailing and it was really inexpensive. And then you just put the lid on and then it has, you know, like the smaller one on top, they interlock so they stay put and they're really nice. So I highly recommend these. I have two others over, actually right over above that way, but um, they're really great. Okay, next is a organizational favorite from my bag. You may have seen a what's in my bag on my Instagram or on my YouTube, and I share these quilted sunglass holders. So they just pop open like this and you could put in your sunnies and then they're perfect for your bag and they are so lightweight. Some sunglass cases are so heavy and this will like lighten your load in your bag or your tote or for travel. I love these and they'll keep them scratch free around your bag. I mean, they're not gonna be crush resistant because they are a soft case, but I don't really have an issue. I keep it towards the top of my bag. I just make sure to do that and then they're perfect. And they come with a white one and they come in a pack of two. There's tons of colors, but I also have one in white. Next is a random office find. It is this calculator. I thought it was so aesthetic and pretty for my desk, but I also do like have like to make random calculations here and there for different things like for my boutique or if I'm, you know, doing some kind of paperwork for my business. I just like, I know I have a calculator app on my phone, but sometimes even if I'm doing something, like something is saving on my phone or whatever, if I don't have my phone nearby, then this is nice to have. And it just like feels so much better than like the phone calculator. I don't know, I just, I just like it and it's aesthetically cute. So I definitely want to include this. I mean, none of this really is necessary, but these make your life so much easier and a lot prettier. We're talking a lot about like florals and whatnot. And if you do get fresh roses or flowers, or if you cut flowers from a garden, or like if you're like me, I like to buy sometimes once in a while, some fresh flowers. These like garden shears are really good. Like when you get in say even grocery store roses, you should cut the bottoms of the stems. And this is a really nice pair from Amazon. Again, these are like super sharp, so just be careful. But they have like this little thing that keeps them shut. And then you just flip this little thing and then they have like that um, spring here. So it's like really easy to cut. And they're amazing at cutting fresh flowers. So. Highly recommend those, especially like for springtime again, or if you're cutting peonies. I know my parents used to have a peony bush at their old house and we would like cut the peonies off. So that would have been like super helpful. And these are really nice. Or like I said, I get grocery store roses sometimes. So 
these would are gonna be coming in handy for me a lot. And then another thing is if you're looking for like a hanger for a wreath, I have been recently like kind of, you know, doing some things around my home outside and this is a really nice wreath hanger. So it just suction cups to your door. Um, I have like a glass insert. I'm not sure if it would work on like a door without the glass. You guys comment below because I'm not sure if it does. So if you guys have one that does work, let me know. My front door that has like the glass insert and this just pops on and I can hang my wreath. I have a wreath that I made by myself. Like I, you know, made the faux flowers in there from, I got a lot from Michaels and it was just so fun to make that wreath. If you guys remember that vlog from last year, I made that wreath in that vlog for my new house and now I have it out and it's so pretty. So um, yeah, I use this though to hang the wreath. All right, let's do a fashion favorite from Amazon. Actually I have two. Um, this is the first one. This is a fashion favorite dress has this bow shoulder detail and it's long. So I shared this over on my Instagram. I, if I share a ton more finds over on my Instagram if you guys wanna follow along there. Um, but this is amazing for just a really darling dress. It's nicely made. I, I love it. It has a smock detail. And um, there was also another one that I already have packed. I'm leaving for my trip tomorrow. So yesterday I packed most of my clothes and I packed my white eyelet one for my trip to Tampa. So it was really hard to like narrow down like from all my recent spring purchases. So the white one is going on my trip with me. And I love it because it looks like an Alice and Olivia look for less. I have it originally in pink. Like I got, I bought that dress from Amazon like three years ago and I loved it so much. I always get compliments on it when I wear it. So I got the white and I love it. So I'm so excited to wear it on my trip. Like I said, I have this one too. I have quite a few other Amazon dresses, but if you guys want to see um, my other favorites, you could check my Instagram stories on my highlight I saved it to my spring highlight. If you guys missed my stories, I actually have been recently, ever since the first day of spring, I've been saving all my, pretty much all my stories into the spring highlight. I have like try-ons and just like random finds from Amazon on there and just every day. So if you guys miss out on my stories, I will always save them pretty much to my spring highlight. Okay, I feel like I said the word highlight like a million times. But next thing, I literally just got this in. So I did not use this technically yet, but I'm really excited to share it because I, Notice sometimes, cause I have like an open like walk-in closet. So I feel like, well, even my closet, like at my old apartment, like it was all, even if I had like a door, I feel like the clothes just get dusty, especially the ones that you don't use for that season. Like, especially like say for now, winter coats and stuff, I wanna cover up to keep dust free because I am, have really bad allergies. And I could tell actually sometimes when I walk into my closet, like I just feel like, allergic or something because it's like it gets dusty over time um so this actually i'll open it up a little bit so you guys can see but i'll have a picture of how it looks this is supposed to be a garment bag for your closet it's 43 inches long and it has like a clear window so you could see like what section you're putting it in so if you have like you know seasonal coats or seasonal clothing like dresses and stuff that are more like fall and winter say for right now then pack them away and cover them up with this, they can still stay hanging in your closet, but I love that I can still see it and it's just gonna stay protected and covered from um, dust and whatnot. So this I'm really excited about. I think it's very practical and useful. And yeah, I think it'll just keep things fresh and like, you know, clean and whatnot for when they're not in use. Okay, I'm just gonna do a couple beauty products favorites in a row. Um, this next one is, actually let's do this. This is really random because this is more like concert related but if you have a special occasion or event coming up for spring and summer even like wedding guests or bridal shower or whatever you want to do and you want to feel glam for the Taylor Swift concert I'm using this powder puff glitter I saw someone on like I searched on YouTube like um like body glitter or something and I wanted I don't think you're gonna be able to see it really from here but you just like pop this thing and it just puffs out the glitter and let me put the little cover on it and it's just glitter. And it seemed like it was like pretty clean ingredients. And this is like so sparkly. I mean, I don't think the camera's gonna do it justice, but it's amazing. And I'm so excited to like spray it all over my body for the concert and even like in my hair. Um, I have this whole like idea in my head of what I'm gonna do for the concert, like with all the glitter and glam and rhinestones too I bought from Amazon actually. And yeah, so this looks so nice. So even for like date night, just do a little like small spritz of glitter, just have that shimmery look. I think it's so cute. Okay, and then I'm also gonna be packing away. These are brand new. I like buy these in bulk. 
So these are the Ardell lashes. I get the naked lashes and then these now I've been loving pre the pre-cut ones because I used to cut them my old one, the other Ardell ones, the Wispies, and now they come in pre-cut on Amazon. I never saw that before. So um, they're great and they're so much easier to work with instead of a full on strip lash. And also if you only wanna apply like two of the pieces like on the edge, it just looks so nice and just natural. So um, these are two of the ones that are my favorite. So I buy them on Amazon in bulk, either Walmart or Amazon. Amazon, I just happened to place a big order. So I got those. Oh, and then this is semi beauty related. This is like a, I don't know what you would call this. It's not a beauty product, but um, this is a hair towel. And I love these Terry hair towels. This is a 100% cotton one. I don't like the ones with microfiber. I don't know. I just don't like the feel of the microfiber. And this is, they're hard to find the 100% cotton, but Amazon had it in this gorgeous blush pink. So I'm packing this away on my trip because I literally, whenever I wash my hair on vacation, I still need to bring this with me because my hair is just always soaking wet. And this helps like dry my hair a little bit faster. I also got these. These are one thing I want to include in my Amazon travel favorites, but these didn't come in time and I'm planning on using these for my self tanning mousse, like the St. Tropez one I'm going to take with me. So they come in these individually sealed bottles. And then they're just like the pump like mousse thing. So I'm really excited. So it just makes any um, mousse product that you wanna travel with, you could take it in this. And it comes in a three pack. So I'm literally after this video, I need to pack cause I am kind of behind in packing. So yeah, I want to, I will be definitely using these right after this video cause I will be going into packing mode. Um, very shortly and then next up is a fashion favorite i love these ballet flats i included these in my spring capsule wardrobe i believe it was that or it was my spring shoe guide this year and i both of those videos are up and i share tons of like must have pieces for your wardrobe and these were one of them they're by the brand ralph lauren and they were a really great price i can't remember the price off the top of my head i feel like amazon sometimes is always changing too but these are so comfortable and i feel like they are so classic they literally go with everything from dresses to workwear pieces to you know if you want to dress up and still wear something dainty but comfortable these are perfect oh i didn't even plan to share this i don't think i've shared this before but my phone case is amazon i've been loving it particularly because it's so functional it has this little strap here that you put charms on it kind of reminds me of a lady doer bag um, but this um you put the charms on i will the charms link separately because you have to buy it all separately so it comes with like you could do someone's name on here i just put my first initial and then a star and a heart and i think it's like very dior it's a quilted case and I particularly love it because I could be like holding my Stanley cup and my phone with me all in one hand and I could be more hands free. I just love it. So definitely recommend if you're looking for a new and cute phone case. Okay. So those were all of my Amazon favorites and must haves for the springtime. I have been accumulating these for quite some time. So I was really excited to share, especially all the faux florals and just all the spring vibes. It just makes me so happy to see all the flowers and whatnot. So I was really excited to share that with you guys. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know if you guys have any favorites or if you try any of these products. I always love hearing from you guys in the comment section. So um, let me know below and stay tuned on my channel. I'll be uploading my Taylor Swift concert and um, Tampa vlog and lots more fun spring content to come on my channel. So I will see you all in my next video very soon. Love you guys. Bye. You're making me, you're making me